what does it say about this team, the way you guys are able to fight back in the, in the third period, at least tie the game? Yeah, it means a lot. Uh, we weren't happy at all with how we played the first two periods and made it an easy night for them. And I felt we were waiting for things to happen when uh, you know what they were getting bounces and, and scoring easy. So uh, the way we played in the third, it was uh, you know, a great comeback. And uh, you know, we grinded them and grinded them. We got to timely power play goals. And uh, you know, some, some guys stepped up. So uh, it was great to see Bernie come in and, and play well. And, and uh, you know what, uh, we came up uh, a little bit short, so we need a better start, and uh, you know we need to make it uh, not as easy on teams coming in. The future of this team is guys like you, Anthony Mensa, as in to see you. I mean, Mensa four assists tonight. How good is that to see him just dominate like that? Yeah, it's great. I thought he was skating really well, and uh, noticed uh, from playing with him that you know I saw him ahead of me a lot of the times on the four check, and uh, while I was skating up the ice, so he he did a great job getting open and. Um, you see his patience and uh, his confidence is, is gaining, and, and for a player like him, that's that's everything. And uh, you know, hopefully, he, he keeps uh, you know, elevating his game as the season uh, season goes on because we're going to need him. How do you assess him? Uh, he's playing good. Uh, he played good hockey all year, and uh, I think he had good legs tonight. And I think uh, our line followed. How much does it help you when you when you play with him? I mean, it seems like you guys have. I've had really good chemistry going back quite a while, and it seems to, whenever, if you need to get out of a drought, putting you with him seems to work. It's fun. Obviously, Dylan's, uh, like I said, the best player on our team this year. Uh, he skates so fast, he opens up a lot of ice for uh, his uh, line mates, and we just use that ice and try to make plays. And I mean, Bird on the four check in front of that, he's hard to play against, so it's a great combination. Obviously, the comeback is great. What do you account for the, uh, the slow start? Uh, it's hard to say. I don't think we were ready from the start, obviously. Um, it shows that we have character in this room. Uh, I think it's the second time in three games that we come back. Uh, we just need to find a way to finish it. Andres, is there a sense on the bench now what you guys are capable of when you really pull yourselves together? I mean, tonight uh, in Philly in the third period. Um, yeah, I mean, I think when we're playing good ho hockey, obviously, it's... Uh, a lot easier for everyone in the room, and I think that uh, when we're playing good hockey. I think we've we've shown how good of a team we are, and that we can, you know, play with any any team really. How much does Dylan lead the way in that? He does a great job. I mean, on and off the ice, he's a really good leader. So it's uh, you know, it's definitely uh, good to have him for sure. What did you think of Mantha and the way he performed tonight with forces? Yeah, I think he played uh, he played well. Obviously, he was finding that open man and. We did a good job of uh, getting that puck to that, that open guy, and you know, it worked out for him tonight. Tough start. Where was the disconnect for you guys? Um, I think just not being 100% ready. I mean, uh, it's tough, obviously. Uh, we had some chances, and we didn't capitalize on them. And, you know, they get their chances and make the most of them and kind of puts us behind the ball and early. And obviously, that's not something we wanted to do. We've talked lots. I mean, part of... What we're trying to do here is, is continue to, to these the young guys continue to grow. Um, you know, I've said it before. I think our, our arc is headed in the right direction, but a huge part of it is their continued growth. And if there's if there isn't continued growth, then uh, we won't be good enough. So those guys got to keep growing. Um, I thought uh, you know Lark and Bert, I'd add Bert, uh, Lark and Bert and Mantha. That line was the best line on the ice. I thought. Uh, uh, throughout the game, and I thought Dubbly heated up as the game went along. And you know, 22 goals now for Dubs, that's a, that's a big number. So um, good for those guys. I thought, uh, you know, you're disappointed you come back for the second time in three games, you don't win in overtime, that's disappointing. Um, I like the fact that we dug in in the third. I thought in the second we just kind of melted. Uh, I didn't like us in the second. I didn't think we dug in when when we when they when we got down. I mean, there's t tons of hockey left. We know they give up lots of goals, and I didn't love our grind at that point. I didn't love our push. And uh, but I thought we came out in the third and attacked the way you have to attack, especially when you're down. And uh, we got rewarded for it. Uh, no, I, I would say the times they had lots of space in the ozone. To be dead honest with you, if you look back, it would be Kane's line, and that's what they do. You know, they can spread you out. They're the Kane's one of the best 
maybe the best player in the world, and uh, there's good, you're going to spend some shifts where they spread you out. Once they get you spread, uh, it's hard to to really pressure because uh, uh, then you're just kind of running around chasing, you know. So I thought. Uh, um, I, I thought it was it was mainly that line. Now we gave up, you know. I thought we gave away goals. I thought in the first, uh, you know, yeah, I can't sit there and say we played bad in the first, but we made uh, we gave away two goals. Obviously, you get the, the, the tough goalie handle that goes in our net, and then you got the uh, uh, you know both the on the wrong side of their guys, and they come in a two on one and score. Um, even on the third goal, we had everybody back. We didn't sort it well enough, but but you got to give credit to DeMarcati. Made a nice little move and got himself open and scored. But but you know I thought we gave him uh, the first two for sure. I thought we had enough chances. Maybe it was whatever. But some of that D zone time uh, that's going to happen against them.